Hey guys, it's Lori at Three Acre Farm. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about garlic. Um, I'll talk about when I plant it, how I harvest it, and what you need to do in between there. So you can see here I have garlic growing along this bed. Um, garlic is actually planted in the fall. You can just grab those little cloves of garlic. You can even get it from the grocery store if you want, or you can order it online. But you plant those cloves in the ground, you just stick them in, kind of like planting tulips. So it's super easy, you do it in the fall, and then you just sit back and relax until about now, which is about the beginning of June here in Michigan. You'll start noticing um, these curly Q things popping up here on your garlic plants. And if we unfold these, you can see that this is actually going to turn into a flower. This is called a garlic scape. And these are actually edible. I'll make another video to show you um, how to prepare them. But what you're going to want to do is go along and check all of your garlic. And you want to remove these. Because if you let it flower, the plant is going to put all its energy into doing the flower. And you want it to put the energy into the bulb to make bigger um, clumps of garlic for you. So you need to go along and pick all of these off. And like I said, they're garlic scapes. Don't throw them away. Hold on to them. I'll show you in another video how I use them to make garlic scape pesto, which is really delicious for lots of different dishes. Um, after you have taken off the garlic scapes, you can sit back again for a while, and you just wait until the tops start to turn brown and fall over. And when they turn brown and fall over, that means it's time for you to dig up your garlic. You let it cure in a dry place for a few days, and that's it. It's a pretty simple crop. So I hope this helps, and be sure to look for the video soon about how to make the garlic scape pesto.